Hey there, welcome to module five, where we're talking about product specific messaging. Now, there is a lot of different messaging that you might need for different products, for different ideas, like to sell a different product. In this module, we're gonna talk about some of the high points, some of the different things that you're gonna need for a lot of different products when you're selling, whether it be kind of service or you know an information product or a coaching program or a membership or any one of these different things that we tend to sell in our space. So we're gonna talk about these kind of to help you so that when you get to the point of creating a sales page, writing emails for a launch, writing emails for a promotion, you're not gonna be struggling as much because if you've kind of nailed the messaging, then it's just a matter of putting that into kind of copy and making it sound the right way. So first, in the next lesson, we're gonna talk about when you've got a product, a big part of what you're gonna do is go back to what we talked about in shifting beliefs and find the mistakes. Find the mistakes and the mistaken belief that you really want to kind of focus on in explaining why your product makes sense. Then we're gonna talk about kind of talking about the solution, which is not about your product, but what is the solution to the problem generally. We're gonna talk about the challenges and identifying and kind of discussing challenges, even with that solution. Why, you know, it's great to say here's the solution, but why it's not always so easy. We're gonna talk about identifying and really talking about what success looks like now again, you should already know what that one is gonna be about, but we're gonna talk about it. We're gonna talk about identifying the core differentiator for the product. Now we've talked about your core differentiator as a brand, as a person. Now this is about the product. You have to identify that core differentiator for your product. Also gonna talk about price anchoring, something that's very important. Unlike most people who tell you to just make up random numbers and say it's valued at, I'm gonna teach you how to think through a meaningful message, a meaningful way of describing what the price anchor, what kind of the value is of your service without just making crap up because making crap up doesn't tend to work so well. So we're talking about that. And finally, we'll talk about inspirational stories, case studies, those things. How do you kind of come up with those? How do you craft those? And how do you do it in an ethical way? We're again, not gonna get into every last detail of writing them, but we're gonna talk about what do you look for? How do you figure out what kind of success stories to look for? What kind of case studies to be on the lookout for? So those are the things we're gonna cover here. It's a module that's action-packed and information-filled, and we're gonna be talking very tactically here and I want you to dive in and understand these things so that once you have these concepts in your mind, when it comes time to write a sales page, to do any of that, it's gonna be much easier for you. So go ahead, dive into the next lesson where we're gonna talk about identifying the mistake and the mistaken beliefs and tying that in with your particular product. So I'll see you in the next lesson.